I run global commercial operations. It's a fancy word for sales operations. We went through a transformation at the beginning of the year because we felt sales um, at the front of sales operations was so limiting. So we wanted to have an orientation to um, a broader commercial lens. And I think that that's important for where I sit in the organization. The biggest obstacle is um, moving from a fact or um, product-based conversation into a more of a dialogue around insights and relevant matters to our clients. Um, we have uh, a tendency to focus inward and go to what's most comfortable, um, and that's about our features and benefits, products, you know, capabilities, versus trying to get into the head and the mind of our clients. And so we're trying to make that leap and make that transformation. So we have two different parts of our business. Um, we have our high growth solutions that are innovative and are kind of early entrance to the marketplace. But the core part of our business is um, where most of our profit resides, um, long-term contracts, but it's not very sexy. It's not, you know, um, uh, not that differentiating. And so what we're trying to do is, you know, put the sizzle back into that truly get at a consumer lens, get at a client lens um, to do something differentiating. Greatest opportunities for advantage in our industry is leveraging a more C-suite relationship. Um, traditionally, we have operated within mid to senior level management. And as we have introduced new solutions um, and are advancing our whole product portfolio, new buyers are coming into the mix. CFOs, CIOs, and CHROs. And we don't have the depth and breadth of the relationships that we need. And so that's an area, if we can develop stronger relationships, I think that the decision makers will come faster to us. So we have been partnering greatly with Corporate Visions around executive conversations. Um, and so increasing the overall business acumen um, beyond our products and capabilities is one of the highest priorities. Um, spending time with our articulating value course that we have within Aon Hewitt gets at squarely at um, what we're hearing in the executive conversations conversation. As I talk with my peers and think about the challenges that are in front of us, retention is primary in all of our minds. Um, and so while we need to move into that double digit growth, the best way to achieve that is through um, maintaining and retaining what you have.